One of these balls is 4% heavier than the other and one of these balls has 77% more of pressure. Can you notice the difference between a paddle and a tennis ball? I asked this question to a professional paddle player and he was quite sure, but I didn't tell him that he needed to do it touching the ball with his eyes closed. Hello to all players, I'm Pablo and I welcome you to a new 4 set. In paddle there are different balls depending on different aspects. Something usual for brands is to develop two different paddle balls, the regular and the fast ball. For example, in Wilson the regular is called por 3 by 3 x 3 or whatever you call it and the fast ball is por 3 speed. Both balls are exactly the same except for one thing, the pressure. The por 3 speed have more pressure, but how that affects to your game? Well, it's really simple. The ball will bounce higher and get more speed. As a rule of thumb, that extra speed is better for players who place in a low altitude city or close to the coast, or in other words, in a slow court. On the other hand, if you play approximately 500 meters or more above the sea level, you should play with the regular balls, or in other words, in any fast court. But let's be honest. You can play more games and at the same time save more money using a ball that has more pressure. But at the same time the first match you play with that fast ball will be quite fast and you will lose control. The price between both kind of balls is almost the same every time so don't worry about that. However, a paddle ball is quite different from a tennis ball, but this was not always the case. When paddle was created in 1969, the founder Enrique Corcuera tried to play with different kind of balls. And which one worked better for him? The tennis balls. So at the beginning, the balls used to play paddle were tennis balls. Until when paddle as a sport evolved and become more professional and at that moment brands saw a business opportunity. There, the conditions that a paddle ball should have were stipulated in the international regulations. And to be honest, for me, it was a good idea. Are paddle balls just a marketing tool for brands? No. Is it impossible to play paddle with tennis balls? No. Are you subscribed to the channel? Unfortunately no, but I hope you do it right now to learn new things about this lovely sport. Should you play paddle with tennis ball? I don't recommend it. You can play paddle with tennis balls, but you will notice the difference and the game will become too fast. So how are tennis balls compared to paddle balls? The first thing and the most important that change is the pressure. Remember that I told you before that there are generally speaking two different paddle balls, the regular and the fast ball. Comparing the faster ball in paddle, a tennis ball has 77% more of pressure. And that is a lot. That will make your game so much fast compared to paddle balls. Look at this image where two balls bounce from the same height. Can you identify the tennis ball? I guess it's easy because the tennis ball bounces higher than the paddle ball. It's not that high, but think that in this experiment both balls didn't have any kind of push. I let the ball bounce. And let's go now with the most important question ever. Which ball can give you more chances to win a smash? Obviously it's the tennis smash, so run to tell your friend that you found why he's never winning a single smash. Besides joke, there are a few more differences between a tennis and a paddle ball. And one of them is the weight. Paddle balls are heavier than tennis balls just for 2 grams. Can you feel that weight difference? Probably you can't. But can a professional paddle player feel the differences with his eyes closed? I want to know if you are able to know which ball is with your blue eyes closed. <laughs> okay. Close your eyes and let's try to guess that ball. That's the first one, here's the second one. Paddle ball. Paddle ball? Yeah. All right. You were right. Let's go one more time, doing less pressure with your fingers. Okay. Okay, okay. close your eyes. And here you have. That's the first one. Here you have the second one. Paddle ball. Paddle ball? Yeah. <laughs> identify the tennis ball pressing it with his fingers because the tennis ball is harder as it has more pressure. But what Jose Solano thinks about playing paddle with a tennis ball? I want to know the differences between the tennis ball and the paddle ball because I saw you how you were playing at defense 
probably you were like more uncomfortable. Is that true? I feel in attack uh, more confidence than in defense. The, the ball, uh, the tennis ball is more faster than the, the paddle ball. Mm -hmm. And in the smash is where you feel more safe, more secure, more confident because your smash, it was like 300 <laughs> kilometers. Uh, with the tennis ball, is more, more faster, mm -hmm. exactly. And would you recommend for amateur players like me to play with tennis ball if we don't have paddle balls to play with? It's better training with paddle ball. Mm -hmm. And the, the professional player is possible for mm -hmm. training the, the reflexes, no? Mm -hmm. And in the professional tour, would you play sometimes with a tennis ball or is it impossible because the points will be super short? No, no, it's impossible. Uh, for the TV and um, the show, uh, uh, we need a, a paddle ball, more, more slow. Well, Jose in this case is like your friend. He's not the best with his mask, so in that term, he prefers to play with a tennis ball. But at the end, he shares my opinion. Playing with a tennis ball makes paddle too fast. So to sum up, I wouldn't recommend you to play paddle using tennis balls. There are important differences between both balls and especially the pressure. If you don't have anything else to play with than a tennis ball, use it. But every time you play paddle, try to do it at least with the fast ball. Actually, remember that using a fast paddle ball can make you to save money because you will play more matches with the same ball. Or if your opponents are Coelho and Tapia, try to use the regular balls to reduce the speed of the game. Let me know in the comments which paddle ball you use in your matches. And thank you for watching the video, like it and see you in the next one. Ciao!